So I was going through the YouTube Studio app earlier today and I saw one of the most recent subscribers was Gert van Leeuw and uh, I saw you are director at Seat Belgium. Now, I recently bought this new car, the Seat Leon. So if you want to work together, like create a video or, or something like this for, uh, for Seat, I would love to team up. And I thought it was snowing a couple of days ago, but this is snow. Look at the car. It's like proper snow now. Like it's gonna stay, as in it's not gonna melt right away. I'm gonna go to the shop real fast because I wanna go before the roads get too slippery. But first I need to grab a shopping bag, which is still in the other car. So let's go to the shop before it starts getting too, uh, too slippery on the road. Now the thing is, I never drove this car in the snow before, so we want to be a little bit careful. Uh, first, let's get rid of the snow. Really, Dario? So apparently battery preservation isn't as good when it's this cold as I left the GoPro in the car and the battery that was in the GoPro kind of died on me. Could only record for a couple of minutes. But after my uh, amazing smart idea of getting rid of the snow in uh, the best way I could think, it's time to go to the shop. So the second battery of the GoPro just died on me. I guess it's just best to not leave your GoPro in the cold for this long. I think it's been there for two, three days. That's a good lesson for the future. I don't think you guys get to see it as much as I do, but it's actually snowing quite a lot, like really a lot, at least for Belgian standards. So we are at the shop and we're gonna do a, uh, a premiere here. We're gonna do a first. I've never really filmed myself a lot in public spaces. So I thought it would be cool to film a bit while going for groceries. Oh, somehow my camera stops detecting my face when I'm wearing this mask. But yeah, it's a bit underexposed, doesn't matter. Uh -huh, this way it works. So we're gonna be filming inside. <laughs> It wasn't too bad actually. I need to check what it turned out like. But I mean, we'll see when we're editing. Editor Dario here. The footage looks pretty good to me. Let's get back to the vlog. Let's start filming more in public spaces. I kind of like the way this, uh, this turns out. We're on a good way. Now this gorilla pod. Let's fix this real quick. Let's keep the pizzas frozen. That's a bit better. Lasagna, let's freeze it so we can eat it at a later date. Same for the macaronis. Let's keep one in the fridge. Next up we got some Coca-Cola, but let's... Same goes for the Fanta. Wurstbrotjes, I don't even know what this is called in English. Literally translated from Dutch, they would be called sausage breads. Uh, it's not healthy at all, it's just very delicious. Don't take any like nutritional advice from me. I just stay very skinny, but it's not like I take care of my own health as much as I should be taking care of it. Also, sometimes people ask me if I eat enough because I look so skinny or well, looks so skinny because I am so skinny, but the thing is I actually eat quite a lot. A lot of fats and, and calories and stuff like this. It's just I don't seem to be gaining weight for one reason or another. I think I just have good genes. I mean, you can tell I don't have a healthy diet. There's like crisps, crisps, more crisps, even more crisps, like Dario, what the hell? And then some waffles. Okay, we're almost there. <laughs> Next I have some soap because we do take showers. I like to just buy a couple of them so I have them ready for whenever I run out. It's kind of hoarding I guess. And then some, uh, I don't even know what they are called in English, but like the things to clean your ears. Editor Dario here once again. Let's look it up right now. Translate.google 
Cottonswabs.com. Touch to English. Rotten stuff. Yes. Cotton swabs. I guess so. L let's get back to the video. Yeah, this stuff. And we're done? Actually not, we're not yet done. Because I bought two more things. Well, it's twice the same thing actually. They're these bad boys. Electricity plugs, which we use which I like using on the, on the set also for travel, but travel obviously is not really possible to, to do right now. Let me just show you. Ah, they're actually slightly different to the one I have, but it's the same idea. It's actually quite straightforward. It's just a cube with electricity plugs in different sizes. Now, why do I like it? Because it says a very small footprint and yet you can put multiple chargers in here at the same time. One of the most common electricity plugs like this are like these long ones and they take up more space than just this small cube with different electricity plugs, but also USB plugs. So it's like really handy. You can, hmm, it's not focusing, but also these USB plugs. So it comes in really handy for when you're on a set and you just need everything to be as compact as possible. So I got two of these, more than enough for a charging station on a set. I used to have one already. Let's add these two in this case. In here, I got a Godox 60 SLW, SL60W, yes. SL60W and I also store some more electricity cables on here for on set so I have all my electricity cables in one place it looks kind of neat it also has these locks on here so you can like proper lock it the case even came with some keys but I don't like using keys because I feel like I'm gonna lose them now it's ready for whatever shoot comes next Let's charge these bad boys. Well, I mean like these GoPro batteries. Luckily, I got a charging station ready. So let's just chuck it in here. Bam, that's number one. Let's go for number two. There we go. And I'll put the GoPro next to my computer just so I don't forget about it. Bam. So I was going through the YouTube Studio app earlier today and I saw one of the most recent subscribers was Gert van Leeuw and uh, I saw you are director at Seat Belgium. Now, I recently bought this new car, the Seat Leon. So if you want to work together, like create a video or, or something like this for, uh, for Seat, I would love to team up. So what do you think Gert? Let's work together. Oh, much better inside. Outside it's too cold, I'm not used to this. So yeah, Gert, if you're interested, you can just leave a comment down below or email me at info at It would be a pleasure, as I'm a big fan of my new car. Like, honestly, nice work, guys. Yeah.